This is DJ Sports Cards in Renton, Washington, home of Tim Lincecum. Tim Lincecum used to actually shop here when he was a kid. But on to other matters. Picked up a 1967 Topps near uh, complete set today. Probably average condition is uh, very good to excellent. Probably closer to very good. Soft corners and things. But a lot of neat star players. And uh, it's mostly complete until you get to the high numbers. I think about number 530 is where it cuts off. The set goes to, I think, about 609. There's Roger Maris with Cardinals. So, books for $5,000 if it's complete and near mint. We're asking $799.95 for this set, as is. You're welcome to come in and take a look at it. I'm trying to give you a good view of it here. Lots of fun stars. Ray Washburn, local area guy. Teaches baseball up at Bellevue Community College. Frank Robinson. Yankees team card. Willie Stargell. There's the Mickey Mantle card. Pretty nice shape, but it does have a little bit of a crease right there in the corner. This is probably a very good condition card. Eddie Matthews with the Astros. Got a lot of guys, a lot of superstars sort of at the end of their careers here. Going to different teams. People say players stuck with one team forever, but they actually they'd get cut a lot by the teams they were loyal to for years, and they'd have to go pick up somewhere else. Speaking of, there's Willie Mays. Finished up his career with the New York Mets. Looks like it's in pretty nice shape. Off-centered, a little bit fuzzy corners. Bob Gibson. Norm Cash and Al Kaline. Trying to get the glare out of here. I apologize for that. Gil Hodges. There's a lot of super league leader cards. Lots of Sandy Koufax on these. He's leading the league in pitching and about everything. But Clemente and Hank Aaron and Frank Robinson. There's a Koufax. Lots of neat stars on these league leader cards. There's plenty of those. Hank Aaron. Neat Willie Stargell card. And that checklist is not written on. Some of the checklists are, some of them aren't. That one looks good. The late Johnny Padres. Lou Brock. Billy Williams. Oh, sorry about that glare. There we go. Let me rotate this over here and see if that fixes things. Bob Euchre. Fergie Jenkins. Neat Killebrew card there. Tops had a lot of fun little specialty cards like that in their sets. They do that in their newer sets as well. 2010 op, uh, top update just arrived. It's got some fun cards like that, I believe. Uh, that checklist has writing. Too bad. Catfish Hunter.
There's Roberto. Uh, that's between a very good and an excellent. No creases. A little bit soft corners. That might be an excellent. Great excellent. Willie Mays and McCovey. It's in pretty nice shape. That's an excellent. That looks good. There's a Denny McLean. White Wilhelm. Don Sutton. And that checklist does have writing. Phil Necro. Killebrew. Uh, almost excellent, if not for that really rounded corner there. Tony Perez, I believe that's a short, I think this Perez and the Palmer are short prints. I think they book for about 60 a piece. They don't look too bad. Those great, excellent. We're getting up into some of the higher numbers here. There's a nice McCovey. Tim McCarver. Juan Marichal. Phil Mazeroski. been in the card business for 25 years and I still don't know how to say this guy's last name. I've had people tell me and I still can't remember. Shindist? Here's Boog. 7th series checklist is not written on. Looks in good shape. Now we get into the high numbers and this is where we start to run dry. So most of the high numbers are missing although there are a few. They're in nice shape. They probably grade excellent. That's a good norm cash there. So the few that are here look nice. Maury Wills. So there it is. We're asking 800 bucks for the set as is. And if you want to come take a closer look, just come down to DJ Sports Cards in Renton, Washington. You can go to our website for directions, djsportscards.com. Our phone number is 425-235-4357. Sign up for our email list at our website. We send out a good email every week with new stuff. We buy and sell sports cards and Legos.